just oh, yeah. about your reaction and, and this whole thing. And, and it being based in a real story, ugh, even more so, right? That's the part that's upsetting, yeah. um, that this happens more than we're told about. And it makes perfect sense when you put yourself in the wilderness. You obviously can be eaten. It makes perfect sense. You go in the ocean. I feel like you were. It's fair game. Yeah. So uh, the experience was um, a little bit terrifying, just because we actually had bears that were visiting the set overnight. And there's nothing you can do about it. It's not like they will stop because there's a film crew. Then not really. Go, not go on your set. <laughs> so you just never really knew when you were gonna see one or if we were in a place and didn't we um didn't we actually see like on the tree the claw marks on the tree oh yeah absolutely yeah so we saw that kind of stuff and i was like mm, i'm not comfortable with this yeah i mean i'm still gonna film it anyway but there was definitely uh that was easy for me to play in yeah. the film just because we were set in that I'm sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah how about for you, Jeff? I mean, seriously, you know, rugged guy, whatever. I'm sure. Are you a camper? I've done a lot of camping. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I it will change my it'll change. I mean, I think I'd want to be with a bigger group of people, maybe camping. Yeah. That uh, gives you a much better chance, and you know, obviously, pack certain gear. Uh, but it, I mean, it's it's a scary film. I think it's it's a primal fear, the yeah. fear of the wild, the fear of. of whether it be a shark or a bear, I mean, anytime I talk to people and they sort of, what's the movie about? I go, oh, this couple gets lost in the woods, and then, you know, what are you, what are you, what are you most afraid of if you get lost in the woods? And everyone says a bear. Yeah. It's like, well, yeah, it's a bear. And, yeah. And not a, not a, not a, not a grizzly, not a Kodiak bear, not a, sort of the cliche from other movies. It's a black bear. Yeah. And it happens, you know, the story that it's based on. It's a, I mean, it, it's, a, it's a black bear attack, and they, they can be more ferocious than any of the other bears because they haven't, they have a, they can go predatory, as they say. And when they right. go predatory, their only goal is to eat you. That's it's it. not about yeah. territory. It's nothing like that. It's only about eating you. And that's different from a, from a Kodiak or a grizzly bear. And uh, it's very rare, but when it happens, and it does happen, I mean, it's scary you stuff. Do. You guys were put through your paces in this movie, no question. I mean, I asked him, you know, I hope he doubled up your pay for sure, you know. But really, <laughs> like, that's, it was a, a strenuous shoot, I, it looked, you know, I'm sure. Absolutely. Yeah. There, was a, there was a difficult scene, if not just more than one every day that I was terrified of, didn't know how it was going to go, and just really had to push myself um, every day. For, and it was a short shoot, but <laughs> definitely the most difficult I've ever done. Yeah. Absolutely. No, it was the most difficult shoot I've ever had, for sure. Uh, both in terms of the emotions that we go to, the yes. shooting schedule, how cold it was. Um, but but at the same time, blissful. I don't know how to, how to explain that. Because you're in nature, and yeah. that's exactly why people go camping and in the first yeah. place, is because you are surrounded by such beauty. <laughs> yeah, was, I mean, that, know, at the end like of the day, you're right, and yeah. And it's wonderful, but at the same time, what you're doing is terrifying, and you're putting yourself through such intense emotion yeah. the entire time. But. No. But we also had such a good shoot just we being did. together with each other and and figuring this out and collaborating and being creative. And, um, every day was also, it was such a win. Yeah. Every time you got through one day, it was, it was so exciting. It, it was so, good. so collaborative. It just, I felt so grateful every day, as hard as it was. I just knew that this is what I want to do. Yeah. This, this, I don't, I, I don't, I don't want to be anywhere else. I really didn't. As hard as it was, I, I shoot probably did, but I didn't. And I just <laughs> really wanted Adam to get the best, best movie he could possibly get. That was always my goal. Yeah. It was that. You know? I really apologize. I just have to do a cough. That's okay. Yeah, go, go, go. Yeah, I'm sick of my voice. I'm out of Yeah. Do you want some water or something? <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry, you guys. Some, you want some water? Totally apologize. No, no, I'm good. I'm good. It's just, you know, you just talk all day and you're like, yeah. Yeah. now it's just started. No kidding. Um, okay, where was it? Um, just, just, um, go, exactly, the emotional part of this, like the, the um, going through in your minds playing these roles, not just so much the physical. Was that a challenge for you guys? There's no way to prepare for that. There was no experience that I had that I could actually, you know, pull from. Um, I had no idea how I was going to feel at all, especially being lost and, I don't know, that's why you just had to kind of show up every day and be present. 
as much as possible. Yeah, yeah. I know. It must have been all. Yeah, trust everybody. Trust that you're getting what you're supposed to do. And trust, you know, the DP, Christian, and he had such an interesting style oh, of shooting. Amazing. Like, literally, where you have no idea what he's shooting. And yeah. you just have to be... That was the other thing. It's not like, oh, this is your close-up now. You never knew when your close-up was. You never knew when he was going to be filming the forest. You never knew when he was going to be behind you or in front of you. So yeah. you just had to give everything in every moment, yeah. which made it exhausting. Yeah. <laughs> well, I think that that, and also to, to, to her point about Christian, the, the, the way the film shot, I mean, you know, it's important that people also see why do people go camping, you know? And it's, I thought that the film was beautifully shot. I thought that, the, that nature looked so inviting in the film. Yes. Um, especially since the audience doesn't know how cold it was. <laughs> yeah. But you see how beautiful it is. You yeah. see why, you know, Alex really wants to take Jen there. You get it. And so And the whole point was to feel it. Too. To feel like you were in that story. Not yeah. watching people, but like... Immersed in it. Yeah, feeling the... Yeah, and we're, we're, we're there with you. Yes. Yeah, and that's the thing yeah. is that because the audience is there with us, Adam didn't spare them anything. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. What scares you? Uh, um, <laughs> lightning? Lightning? <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, I don't like lightning. I don't like driving on the 405. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Absolutely. How about you, Missy? Uh, I mean, I can be afraid of everything if I want to. There's always something that I always. prepare for to go wrong. Or, uh, you know, I think it's an attitude. Sometimes when I feel vulnerable, I am afraid of literally everything. Plane going down, being lost. Uh, anytime that I have to be outside of my comfort zone. But at the same time, you, know, you change your mind, and then I go, well, I'd rather actually live. And so then everything that terrifies me actually drives me to, to go and face those things and live. Well, you surf, right? Yeah. See that? And that doesn't scare you? Like, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, All the time. Yeah. Oh my God. Because I know that I'm at risk, and I know yeah. that anything can happen. And, um, yeah. That's again. But you gotta live life too, right? Right. Yeah. 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 Quickly, you're, like Ricky Blue, still going so strong. Are you yeah. still having a fun time? I am, because I love the people I work with. It's still really fun. Um, I'm tired right now, obviously, because we're almost done with the yeah. 22 season. But. Uh, you know, as much as I'm exhausted, I go to work every day, and it's so easy, and it's such a well-oiled machine, and uh, I love the people that are like my family now, so. Good stuff. It's good. Good yeah. stuff. Well, you guys did a great job in this. Congratulations. Thank you. Next time when you do a bear movie, just make sure they're hibernating. Yeah, there you right? go. You know? Yeah. That's, when you go guy, That's when you go camping. That's when you go camping. a guy out there who... One of his hobbies was in the winter to go, and this guy was like oh, a rugged dude. Don't tell me. Poke to go them? and poke a bear. No, no, no. That makes he no poked sense. a bear, and then he was asked, "Why did you poke the bear?" He goes, "To see what it would do." Oh. <laughs> and you deserve what happens. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so great talking to you guys. Congratulations, Thank and uh, best of luck much. with everything. Thank right you. On.